to talk about the versions. Um, there's a lot of conversation at the moment with the Microsoft OneNote and all the versions. So I summarised it and really just thought I'd put it out there just to help bring some clarity to everyone. There's OneNote for Windows. Now this is the version OneNote. It formerly was called OneNote 2016. And if you look down the bottom here, down here, OneNote is the version that will continue to be supported after October 2025. So that's two years away, the end of, oh, it's nearly three, all of 2023, all of 2024, and most of 2025, all of these versions but exist, will exist. But in three years' time, this OneNote here, this OneNote, which used to be one, OneNote 2016, that one will continue to get support from Microsoft. Okay, so there's also the version OneNote for Windows 10. Excuse me. There is the version OneNote for Mac. There is a version when you log on with your internet browser, OneNote for the web. There is that version. There is a version that you have access to on your phone, your actual iPhone. And there is a companion OneNote app for the Apple Watch, which is available after you install OneNote on your iPhone. There is a version of OneNote for the iPad, and there is a version of OneNote for Android. So I just thought I'd put that out there because I know a lot of people talk about it and it can feel confusing at times, but one, two, three, four, five, six, and one note for Windows 10 is seven. Seven versions there is currently of OneNote, just so you're aware of that and can factor that into however you are using it. That's all for now. Thanks.